So today on the Blackstone, we're going to go ahead and make some sausage, bacon, or bacon, sausage, and uh, hash browns on here with a little bit of eggs. Uh, so we've got this thing on medium low, just kind of going to do it low so we don't burn anything. Had it running for a little while preheating, and I'm going to go ahead and place this bacon on this 20 inch, 28 inch griddle. It's also kind of cool outside today, temperatures in the 30s, so. Starting to hear a little sizzle. Just got it set to low so I don't get to worry about burning anything. We got several things going on today. This bacon, a little bit of sausage. Okay. Squeeze that in there. Let's go ahead and add this sausage to it. Save room over here for our hash browns here in a little bit. Add those to it. Just got some frozen hash browns I've put in the fridge. Nothing fancy. Okay. Let's let that cook for just a little bit. And I will say the wind is up a notch today. This little uh, lid that it basically, you cover it when you're done cooking, let you put it right here, actually helps block some of that wind from coming through the back. The sides don't have any blockage, but helps with uh, some of the wind blockage. So that's up uh, helping do that. So let's let this cook for just a little bit. And then, like I said, just some packaged hash browns in a bag, and I'm just going to throw that over here. But first, I'm going to put a little oil. Let me get that. I'm just going to put a little bit of olive oil on there. Just place this right there. Do a whole bag. Turn it up just a little bit, get the heat going a little more. It is cold outside, and uh, we get this kind of brown a little better. It looks good so far. I'm just going to let this cook a little bit. And if you are new here, uh, I want to go ahead and welcome you to subscribe. This is the Oki Smoking Channel, and I want to uh, welcome you to the channel. My name is John, and I cook on the uh, uh, Blackstone. Be sure and uh, subscribe and like. Got this cooking up just a little bit. After this is all done, I'm going to cook some eggs to finalize it here in a little bit, but I'll just let it uh, set here and cook for a bit. Flip these a little bit. The center gets the hottest on this thing. Still not browning a whole lot yet on this bacon, so still got a ways to go. Could get it brown a lot quicker going in fast paced mode, but like I said, I don't want to burn anything. Had uh, got this to cook, so we'll just go low and slow a little bit until we get there. Just kind of let these set a while and just every now and then mix them. Flip that sausage here in just a moment. A 
Look at that, nice and brown. A little potato in there, that's all right. Come here. There we go. <laughs> Some of these that are getting a little more done, I'm going to put down here where it's not quite as hot. Kind of move them around a little. Those in the center. Put that guy right there. I do usually use metal, but they're dirty, I suppose. So I got the silicone ones. On this low heat, it's not melting them, but you got to kind of be careful, especially if you get it up real high. That's a nice look right there. Nice and golden brown. So you learn where your hot spots are, and we're going to move some of the ones that uh, need to get closer to the hot spot over here. These at the top ain't getting as hot either, move them down a little bit. Squeeze it somewhere right in here if we can. Starting to get a little bit of a brown on these uh, potatoes here. Don't want to mix them too much. I'm going to let them just set. And uh, brown a little bit, and then we'll flip them. As they start to look like they're getting pretty close to done, I'm going to shoot them right up here where they don't get quite as hot. Let them hang out. Now we got all of them getting brown on this sausage. Yeah, just like I like it. I mean, this is fun. Just come out here on this uh, flat grill and just cook breakfast, hash brown sausage. No pancakes today. Next time I'll do pancakes, maybe instead of hash browns. Uh, it, it's just really awesome. One device, cook it, no pans. Even when it's 38 degrees outside like it is right now, it takes a little longer uh, because it is a little chilly out here. Uh, also uses a little more gas and all that, but it's all right, it's all right. Ah, they're starting to look like what I want. So you see that gold come in there, a little bit of a crunch to them. Those are about ready. 
We're going to set those aside here in a minute. Throw a couple eggs on. Let it cook a few minutes there. Maybe about another 60 seconds to two minutes and then uh, flip them and we'll just go ahead and start some eggs. those hang out over there for a bit. Scrape some of this. And a dash of olive oil, a dash of butter. Come on, yeah, there we go. Mix that all in there. A lot of butter, a little bit of oil. Get that melted down. Whoops, lost an egg. Did have four there. A little salt, a little pepper, I turned the burner down to low because I wanted to make sure I didn't cook the eggs too fast. And these hash browns and everything still got heat, still cooking. Divide them up if you want like that. Looks like they're about ready to flip, so I'm going to flip them here in a minute. I think they are, so we're going to... Maybe just a dash more salt on top. Pepper. Breakfast is served. Let's take these eggs off. Looks beautiful. Hash browns look pretty done. You can even leave them on here and crisp a little more. I'm gonna take this bacon off now. I did after I took this off just turn the heat up a little bit just to brown these a little more to it is cold outside and just kind of get them a little browner and I'm fixing to pull them off and then we'll have some breakfast
and make sure you don't scoop it where that grease uh, drain is. You'll lose hash browns. So I went ahead and made me a little plate here. Get my hash browns. I already cut a piece of sausage there. I'm going to try that first. Mm -hmm. Try a little bit of this egg. Hash brown. And there's just something about cooking breakfast outside on this. It just tastes so much better. Excellent, excellent. Mm. <laughs> you see more cooking videos on the grill, Blackstone, and the uh, yeah, pit barrel. Be sure and subscribe. I'll see you in the next video.